But the title of the the working title of this piece is The Pirate Kids. And it goes something like this. The cabin was dark, and the captain was brooding. It had been three weeks, three long, boring, joyless weeks, without any chocolate to speak of. If Captain Joe, J-O, if Captain Joe, the pirate ship Athanasia, Athanasia, had any weakness to speak of, it was sweet. Chocolate was a particular favorite, not just of Captain Joe, but of the entire crew. She was starting to fear that if the next ship they plundered didn't have a supply of sweets, there would be an uprising. The, so the third sentence, the first paragraph, three long, boring, joyless weeks without any chocolate to speak of. Like, that just, that lands for me. <sighs> that resonates. Right. Mm. <laughs> and I think it will resonate for a lot of readers. Yes. Um, and if, I, almost, like, I don't think there's a way to put it in the first sentence, and I don't necessarily want you to, but it's a great way to end the first paragraph. Mm-hmm. Like, chocolate, done. Yes. Like, the, if I'm right about the middle grade, um... This, I feel, I'm, I'm assuming that the plot is going to have something to do with getting the chocolate. Maybe it doesn't, but we. But number one, what did you do? You introduced a conflict immediately. First paragraph, mm-hmm. there's a problem. Mm-hmm. We don't have chocolate. Now, whether or not that's the plot for the whole book, I'm in, because now i got to know, are they going to get chocolate? Mm-hmm. And yet chocolate is not exactly saving the world. It's not a dragon. It's not the Hunger Games. It's not the stand. It's chocolate. Everybody relax, okay? But... In this world, it is a dragon. It is the stand. It is the end of the world, mm-hmm. right? And that's one of the things I love about it.